Taylor Swift shades Scooter Braun in a new song, plus Zayn Malik upsets One Direction fan. Hey guys, Devontae for Hollywood Life with your music update, starting with Demi Lovato and her recent engagement. We're hearing exclusively that Demi's family is very happy for her. We're told the fam are all very grateful that Max came into her life and the timing couldn't have been better. The past few months with all the isolation has been hard on a lot of people, but Demi and Max have found a silver lining. They've been able to spend all this time together and that's been a huge blessing in so many ways. I'm switching gears to Kanye because at the time of this recording, the new album he promised everyone today still hasn't dropped and I'm quite surprised at how surprised fans are. Kanye's done this for at least the last two albums or more, so you had to see this coming. But regardless, he's going through a lot with his mental health at the moment, so don't attack the man on social media over music. It'll release when it's time. But speaking of new music, Taylor Swift surprised fans with her eighth studio album, Folklore, today. And I've gotta admit, sounding pretty damn good. So let's talk about it a bit. Like how fans think My Tears Ricochet is dissing Scooter Braun. Taylor said the track is about a quote, embittered tormentor showing up at the funeral of his fallen object of obsession. Fans think that tormentor is Scooter and the stolen lullabies she sings about are her first six albums that Scooter bought the rights to. But it's not all drama because Taylor also showed some love to her friends, Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds, and used their daughter's names to tell a fictional story in the track, Betty. And speaking of her friends, Selena Gomez was photographed out wearing folklore merch before the album even dropped. And considering Cell recently turned 28, I'm thinking this was probably a birthday gift. But okay, One Direction fans are pissed, but only at Zayn. Let's talk about why. Yesterday was the 10th anniversary of the band being a band, and all the members except for Zayn took to social media to acknowledge the day with touching messages to each other and fans. Plenty of fans took to Twitter to sound off and slam Zayn, but not everyone was surprised considering the singer has spoken out about his time in the band during interviews last year. One user said, quote, am I surprised Zayn hasn't said anything? No, but am I still sad about it? Yes, very sad actually. But all right guys, make sure you hit that sub like and bell button, comment the word hot sauce or ketchup and stick with us for all the latest.